So, girl, I guess Thunder Girl and Asian Doll are beefing now. I don't know why, because Asian Doll, sis, you ain't had a career since Vine died. And Thunder Girl, we ain't gave a f about you since you tried to call Biggie out for eating pussy and she gave your ass a two piece in the biscuit and straightened your lace front, okay? I don't know who told y'all y'all was the moment or what's going on, but baby, listen, we don't really give a f about none of this shit, okay? Let's talk about it, baby, because this is a big deal. Let's go. Ugh. Oh, shit. Here we go again. comment and subscribe subscribe for me daddy subscribe for me daddy subscribe for me daddy let me see your grill and do me one more favor and turn on my post notifications so you can be alerted when i upload a new video girl let's get into the tea so baby sit on down this is bullshit okay listen look uh girl now i know i still got a lot of fans of the little rap bitch that sit at my table, and that's okay. Y'all can stay. But this ain't got nothing. Don't take this personal. This ain't got nothing to do with me and Stunner Girl, you know, previous history, girl. This is just me reading the blog, and I'm going to comment on it, okay? So, if y'all don't know what had was going on, uh, two days ago, Asian Doll and Stunner Girl got into it on Twitter. I don't know who started it, to be for real with you, because bitches delete tweets. I don't know if they did. I'm not saying they did. I just don't. I, I, when I looked at both of their pages, I can't really see who started stuff. Okay. I saw Asian Doll subbing Stunner Girl. I'm assuming Stunner Girl maybe subbed Asian Doll beforehand, but I didn't see any of that on Stunner Girl's page. So I just saw from the start of it, it looked like to me Asian Doll was subbing Stunner Girl after something she saw that Stunner Girl might, have, might or might not say it about her. Um... After that, Asian Doll goes into the, oh, these bitches don't know me. I never knew these bitches. All of that, you know, trying to play the whole um, Mariah, the, the, the whole Whitney Houston role. I don't know her. You know, the whole Mariah Carey. I don't know her. Who is that, you know, card or whatever the case is. Then Stunner Girl responds and says something about uh, like that, her song like that, saying that her career is more more famous than um, Asian Dolls and that like that, you know, alone tops anything she's ever done in her career. You know, Asian Doll then came back, girl, and she got messy, baby. All right, girl, she said that. <laughs> I'ma just let y'all read it. Baby, this girl went the off on Stunner Girl, okay? She accused her of being a, a, a professional pussy saleswoman, you know, uh, back in the day. And Stunner Girl has already said to herself that she used to sell her coochie lips from here to too. okay? She slung that pussy like a slingshot from L.A. County to the Bay Area, baby, and um, it ain't no secret. So we already know that. But here's my thing with y'all. I don't know. Asian Doll, can I start with you? Okay, so Asian Doll, sis, you have fallen, okay? I don't know if you if you have not woke up and smelled the coffee yet, sis, but you have fallen from grace, sis. We used to care about you, okay? We used to know you. Uh, baby, back before Vine, you know, you was, you you know, you 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 and Cuba had y'all moment when y'all was doing y'all little thing, then you was doing your thing on your own. You got a lot of good features from a lot of good artists. You was really popping as one of the hardcore drill rap, uh, is that what they call that, drill rap or whatever, artists. Baby, you got with Vaughn, and it was just like, you know, we didn't even know you no more. Like, you know what I'm saying? Your whole life, you no, know, like most women do, y'all get with a nigga, and then your whole life become about that nigga. And, you know, your, your whole life became upholding Vaughn and his legacy and what he had going on. Then when he died, that's all you talked about. And you really faded into the background, and we got so tired of you talking about him, we didn't give a fuck about what you were saying no more, no shade. Um... Needless to say, sis, you ain't had a hit in forever. You ain't had a hit since none of that shit. And we don't care about nothing you doing. So, um, baddies is kind of your Hail Mary, sis. It's your, set, it's your lifeboat at this point. Let's be for real. Without baddies, who the fuck would Asian doll be right now? Who are you? Who do We don't know you. We don't know you. We don't care about you. Your career is over. You pushing 30. Okay, you didn't you didn't BBL'd out, baby. You didn't, you didn't, you didn't, you didn't blow. You got blow up titties and a BBL and, and, and it ain't worked for you. And that's not me being rude, Asian doll. That's for real shit. You ain't got time to be worried about no damn stunning girl. Girl, your career is over. Like, like girl, y'all is... 
Girl, okay, let me go ahead and go on over to Stunner Girl too, because y'all both about to get the same read. Every time you open your mouth, it got something to do with somebody that's on Zeus. You ain't said shit about Asian Doll in the last three, four, five years. First of all, I thought y'all was partners in crime because last time I checked, she was besties with Cuban and Cuban hired you as the hitman that went and put Rocky in the cage. So how the hell is you mad at the bitch you was doing dirt with a couple years ago? Now, I do understand that Asian Doll did come out and try to distance herself from Cuban and, um, Cuban and Sunny Girl after all that stuff happened. But sis, no shade, baby. You are as good as the company you keep, bitch. And you was hanging with them, so girl... I always looked at you as one of them, one of the low lowlifes that do stuff like that. Honestly, Asian Dial, no shade. Ooh, how I get back on reading Asian Dial? Anyway, let's spin a block. Stunner Girl, you got a lot to be worried about right now, okay? You got that imaginary ass network. We heard you done lost your job allegedly over there at Ray J Network. You know, you done lost your job at Zeus. You know, you over there staring at, uh, from Piddle to Poe, Airbnb to this, Airbnb to that. Girl over there lying about shows, being in production, and you ain't even got a motherfucking, um, 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 just got an Instagram page, what, two minutes ago. But, um, with that being said, Stunner Girl, girl, you got a lot to worry about right now, okay? You and Asian Doll can't offer anybody, each other anything. Notice y'all beefed and the only blogs y'all hit was Zeus affiliated blogs. None of the Shay Room didn't pick it up. Jason Lee blog didn't pick it up. Nobody cared. Jasmine Brand, none of the neighborhood talk. Nobody cared. Okay? Meaning, the clout chase thing you're doing, it didn't work this time, sis. You are, are, are repeating this cycle of trying to clout chase everybody at Zeus who, 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 who you think got a name. And it's, it's not gotten you anywhere. It ain't gotten you back on Zeus. You know what I'm saying? It ain't gotten you not one more fan. It ain't gotten you not one more dollar in your pocket. Okay? So, uh, yeah, you know what I'm saying? You tried to clout chase me when I was making the blogs uh, last month. It didn't get you nowhere. You know what I'm saying? Nobody screen records your lives anymore. I, if you look up Stunner Girl Lives on YouTube, they're going to have, what, 10, 15 views? Nobody cares no more, Stunner Girl. Okay? Nobody cares. Both of you bitches are 30 year old washed up has been ass rappers with hard titties. Okay? And um, 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 what you call them motherfucker? BBLs that look like a kid traced it. So, with that being said, I think both of y'all. Uh, Mother, uh, childless, I'm sorry, I said motherless, childless, husbandless ass, uh, moolah don't count, cause, you know what I'm saying, we don't give a fuck about him, but yeah, moolah don't count, so both of you, uh, both of you, uh, childless ass, husbandless ass, careerless ass bitches got a lot more to worry about than who talking shit about who on Twitter, okay, it's petty, y'all 30, get over it, ugh, who the fuck argues, who argues with a bitch they don't see every day at 30? Asian doll, you giving Stunner Girl more energy than I did. And I actually interact with the bitch you don't. I actually review the, the, review the network she's a, she was a part of. You and this bitch ain't had nothing to do with each other in years. Why are y'all talking? Okay? Y'all got too much time on y'all hands. I know you bitches ain't making no money. But Asian doll, sis, um... I'm going to read you because you're going to be on baddie. So I'm going to read you all season. But uh, Stunner Girl, I would really like to forget about you. I, I just wish you would stop talking to people who are Zeus affiliated. If anybody touches Zeus, Stunner Girl, you just don't say nothing to them until they get away from Zeus. Please. So we can just forget about you. Like we want to real bad. We really want you to just go under a rock. Go under Patrick's rock, bitch. And stay there. Okay? We really want you to dig a hole, jump in that motherfucker, and just have Moolah put dirt on top of you. And just come get you in 10 years. We don't care. Okay? You is trying your, your best to carve your way back into this Zeus equation, sis. Either go over there and accept the motherfucking $25,000 check, bitch, because you ain't getting nothing else, or shut the fuck up, okay? Because we really tired of it, baby. And that's my that's that's really my wholehearted opinion. That's my, that's, that's, that's my advice to you, boo. I'm not even being rude at this point because I'm sick of it, okay? I'm, try, I'm not trying to be rude, but I am because I'm sick of it. But, yeah. What is this? And then furthermore, on another tip, Asian now talking about she had beat the fuck out of Stunner Girl. Girl, you are 30. Uh, sit your old ass down, bitch, when you break a hip. What are you talking about? You about to be out in a, in a street, auntie? Y'all old ass is about to be out in the street rolling around in the dirt with them hard ass titties. Sit down. Girl, uh. Uh. Why do y'all think that is cute to be fighting at 30 and 40 and 50? Ugh! You street rat ass bitches. Girl, anyway. Look, girl. Asian.
Asian dial, just get, you fight who you getting paid to fight. Fight the bitches on the TV show. That's who you getting paid to fight. Do your job. Come to the reunion. Get punched in the eye again. You know what I'm saying? Uh, or punch Mariah weak ass in the eye because, you know, you only going to fight the weak bitches. You ain't going to fight no tzatzikis and nothing like that. You know, so uh, go ahead. Get your little 10 minutes of fame, girl. And go the way to Dodo Bird. Okay, we, we need the next round of bitches to come on in. But, but since all this extra stuff, we don't care about. Okay, y'all doing too much and it's too weird. And you two bitches is, is really too gang affiliate. First of all, let me start here. Well, let me let me let me jump into this. Both of y'all still being in the streets at 30 is pathetic. I mean, God, it's it's like it's laughable, actually. It's actually laughable. Okay. Uh 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 both of y'all bitches being able being able to be called on to go do dirt or fight a bitch or jump or do anything like that at a moment's notice by another motherfucker or doing that for anybody. Anything that can lead you to jail at age of 30. It's laughable. Ha. Okay. But what can I expect? You know, um, GEDs only get you so far. But with that being said, I feel like this. This can get dangerous real quick. Okay. Um, let me just let me just put that out there. This can get dangerous real quick because both of you bitches are, you know, um, um, special ed mumble rappers. You know, y'all, y'all, y'all don't see, y'all don't, y'all can't see the forest for the trees. All y'all see is what's in front of y'all. Y'all don't see the next five years, the next 10 years. I don't even think y'all see the next 10 years for yourself or your careers. I don't even think neither one of y'all thought y'all would make it this far. But, um, this, this, yeah, yeah. Yeah, y'all, this will get bad. It can get bad. It can get real bad, real ugly, real nasty. And I really don't want, you know what I'm saying, for one of y'all to see each other and hurt each other. You know what I'm saying? Because whether I think that both of y'all are washed up or not, y'all are still two, you know what I'm saying, um, well, one black woman and one other. Um, you know what I'm saying? Y'all two women. And at the end of the day, y'all don't need to be going through this, especially at 30. Y'all just, it just don't look, it's just, girl, girl. Girl, <laughs> y'all look a fool. Y'all look a fool. Um, Asian, Stana, get to the bingo hall. That's, yeah, get to the bingo hall. Get to the booth. Give us a hit. Give us a hit. Both of you bitches. Can we get a hit this year? Okay, not, not, not the hit. We want a hit. We want y'all both in the booth. Can we get a hit? Okay, I don't want to hear shit from either one of you bitches until y'all produce a hit. Okay, from this this year. Okay, this 365 days. We want a hit now. Not a remix. We want a hit. Okay, if y'all can't produce no hit, bitch, don't produce no drama. Thank you, and y'all have a great day, okay? My Ugh, girl, just ugh.